guys it's about to get real um holy cow pull that up slowly i don't know if that's real or not dude What is going on everybody? Treasure Coast Magna Fishing and more. We're out here on a new adventure today. We're down in Stewart, Florida. And as you can see, got a few buildings here. This is actually a children's museum. It's a park. We got all kinds of stuff. We are gonna hit this boardwalk out here. It's a pretty big one. And if we don't have much luck or if we have enough time, there's some boat ramps over that way we're gonna hit. So uh, buckle up. We're gonna head out on this adventure. Check out that crusty lure I just pulled up. That thing has seen better days for sure. All right, got some weight this time. What is that? That's an old piece of cast iron pipe. That's what that is. You know, that's crazy. Me and Easton hooked a piece of pipe that's got to be at least 20 feet long and at least 8 inches around. We can't get it up, but uh, I think there's some old pipe laying around out here for sure. To get there first throw. Got a nut with a leader. It's like somebody was trying to use a nut for a weight. Hey, whatever works, right? <laughs> Good job. All right, guys, it feels like I'm tagging something. I don't know, I keep catching on the rebar down here. Oh, what is that? I definitely got something. That is a super old crusty pocket knife. Holy cow, that thing's been down there a long time. Look at the crusties on that. That's wild. All right, I feel something tagging on here, guys. <laughs> Check it out. Sweet old pair of pliers. I think I found the end of the concrete in the boat ramp. And this is the kind of stuff that's hiding down there. Check it out. All right, we got something this throw. What do we have on here? Looks like more boat trailer parts. Got a big bolt. That looks like a piece of uh, leaf spring off a boat trailer. That's what that looks like right there. All right, that knife I pulled up a few minutes ago. Easton said it was pretty shiny underneath all the barnacles. So I started popping them off and the blade's in really good shape. But it looks like the rest of it's just busted to pieces. I don't know if it's gonna be repairable or not, but who knows? We might be able to restore that. And it's made by Fury. Made in China. See what Easton got here. Got an old crusty hook. Oh yeah, that thing's been down there for a long time, and you got a small one on there too. Man, yeah. nice, good job. Check this guy out. He means business. He doesn't want us here. Look at the claw on that guy. That's what she said. All right, let's see what Easton's tagging over here. Besides crabs, they are all over the place. Ooh. Dude, what do you got? Look at the size of that hook. Man, we are filling the tackle box today. What is that? That is a really big nail. Ooh, look at that nail, and it's spiraled too. That thing is huge. All yeah, right. Too, Good job getting that stuff out of the water. Holy cow, look at the size of this hook, guys. We found this little tiny boat ramp off the beaten path here. We figured we would give it a shot. Why not, right? This little cove right here. First throw out there. I get this hook like somebody was trying to catch jaws out here. All right, second throw. What did we get? Ha <laughs> ha, look at that. Big old fillet knife. And that one doesn't look like it's been down there that long. It's pretty green. What does that say? Ozark Trail. I think that's a Walmart fillet knife, but still in good shape, still usable. All right, magnet feels a little bit heavy, guys. Let's see what we got on there. Ha 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 ha! Check it out. We got an old beat up shrimp jig, and look at those needle nose pliers. They look like they're bright pink. Dude, they still work. Get out of here. No way. What? No way. Guys, check it out. They're actually in good shape. 
needle nose going in the toolbox. All right, Easton got himself an unidentified object. Dude. What the heck? It's got little... Two little silver balls in it. Is that part of like a thermostat or thermometer of some kind? I don't know how well you can see that. That's weird. And we got some old, old Budweiser. That, oh, oh no, Miller High Life. Look at that. Oh. That's what that is. Miller High Life representing, guys. All right, what you got there, big guy? Coors Light. Oh, Coors Light. Head to the mountains there. You got a broken hook, too. Oh. And there's another yeah, piece. You got a bunch of broken hooks. Hook. Yeah. Good job getting the trash out of the water. Coors Light right there. Going in the bucket, yo. Going on down here. Oh, what do you got? Got a bungee. That is a grungy bungee right there. Yeah, it is. Yeah, nasty. Put that thing in the bucket, yo. It says he's tagging something. What do you have? Dude, check it out. I think that's what they call a catfish cowbell and a hook. That is freaking awesome. Into the phone uh, to look use. at that. Yeah, iPhone to headphone jack. That is cool, dude. This isn't the first electronic. Remember, we got a charger last time we were here. All right, I see stuff on there. Oh, I think it's a cell phone. I think it's a smartphone. That looks like an old bubbler right there. And, man, another leader, a rotten hook, another hook, more bread ties, and we are representing Michelob Ultra. All right, I'm still searching for the phone that I dropped. That is not a phone, but what is it? it looks like, I don't know, maybe a piece of a drill bit or something. And a bottle cap. All right, I'm searching for this phone. I haven't found it yet, but... Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! Look at all of that fishing gear. One hook, two hook, three hook, one, two, three bullet weights. Oh, got to go back for that one. And a catfish cowbell. Look, oh, look at that. Guys, it's about to get real. Um, holy cow. Pull that up slowly. I don't know if that's real or not, dude. Oh, it's a toy. I'm pretty positive it's a toy, but there's a... What the hell? Guys, this is not a toy. Look what Easton just pulled up. Holy cow. That is freaking old. And it's got a bag wrapped around it. Wood grips. Looks like we're about to make a phone call, you guys. And actually, let me keep that aimed away. We have no idea if it's loaded or anything. And let me put gloves on. That thing is awesome. All right, our first complete gun, dude, and that is an old one. Good job, man. All right, guys, I think we got a bike down there. I just pulled up some bike parts, but we have the police showing up here since we pulled up a gun. Let's go see what they have to say about it. See if we get to keep it or not. Hello. How you doing? We're YouTubers. Camera's rolling. Just letting you know. Okay, sir. Alrighty. Here, let me bring this out to you in the light so you can actually see it better. It's kind of dark under there. That is it. It looks like a... I thought it was like an old Colt, like a really old gun when I pulled it up. Mm -hmm. But on the side of it, we scraped the edge and it's a company out of Miami. Mm -hmm. And my daughter looked it up, and I guess they make replica guns of old guns. So it had a piece of uh, black plastic wrapped around it when we pulled it up. Okay. So it may not even be like a real gun? I think it's a real gun. Okay. Um, you want me to pull it out so you can look at it? or? No, I'm going to get close. Okay. All right, no problem. Take a peek. What in the world is that? That is a children's toy, the magnet. So you can oh, it's the little, out yeah, baby magnetic toys. Check that out. Another got a hook. sweet hook. Cool deal. Good finds. What do you got? Whoa, look at that spoon. Dude, 
The spoon itself is in great shape. The hook is looking a little bit rough. Check out that spoon that Easton just pulled up. I got a nut. Oh man, got the leader and all with it. Sweet. All right, guys, I think this is a cell phone that I dropped earlier. It's an LG. It is. Ha ha ha. Got. Whoa. <laughs> okay. It's part of a cell phone. <laughs> I got it, guys. There it is. LG. That's what I got earlier. Easton's got something that's making him giggle like a I little. I got a steel tuna canna. Uh, tuna canna. All right, Easton got a sealed can of something. Tuna. I don't know if it's tuna. Dude, look at that. That's one of those hooks like we were getting oh out there. My. Whoa, what is this? What the heck is this? It reminds, oh, you know what this is? This is an old hair clip. <laughs> yeah, it is. It's all bent. See, look, it's got little stones and stuff in it. Cool find, dude. All right, I switched to using Easton's magnet. He's taking a break. What did I get? Check out that knife, dude. Every time we're here, we get stuff. It's like a karambit knife. Yeah, it is like a karambit knife. Portland, Oregon. You mean to tell me this thing's actually made in America? Here, see if you can open it. See if you can open it, not swing it around, dude. All right, I feel something else on there. Is that another cell phone? I think that's the first one I actually grabbed. That looks more like it that take off the case see what it is let's take off the case and see what it is guys any money in it you know sometimes there's money in it samsung galaxy note 8 that's really not that old considering dude that is super cool another one for today all right i see something colorful on there what is that that is a brake cable for like a BMX bike that was blue and oh they're broken a sweet little pair of vice grips I was excited I thought they were gonna be good ones but they are not they are broken all right guys man the hits just keep coming here so it feels like we're hooked on a bicycle or something down there deep in the mud and we just pulled up this that is our second knife here today. I saw a bag fall off. And we got a gun already too. And I saw a piece of bag fall off from the gun we pulled up earlier. So we're going to keep throwing right here. There could be more stuff down there. Whoa! He got spooked. I just came over to record him. That was wild. Hope we caught that on video. This is insane, guys. Another phone. This one's an iPhone. Eight look at that i cannot believe this place today that's my phone two knives a gun and this is the third cell phone all right guys we are gonna wrap it up get a little bit of this uh sunset action going on out here got a gator swimming by we had a very productive day magnet fishing today knives got a gun so we are going to wrap this beautiful day up with telling you guys bye and we will see you on the next adventure peace, peace.